everybody. It's Carla. How's everybody doing right now? I hope you're having a great day. And I was trying to wait for my trash man to stop with his beeping horn. But I thought he was gone. Nope. Whoop. Oh my goodness. Time out while we wait for the trash man to finish in the alley. I think the trash man is gone. <laughs> I got two things uh, from Amazon this weekend and I wanted to show you. Uh, the first thing I got were these uh, Let's Resin. I'm, I'm, I'm doing it like that because I'm looking at that screen over there. Uh, the Let's Resin Glitter Powder. Um, I'm getting to this thing where I love coloring the resin with glitter. I have a couple of them out right here. A, a blue, red, and a gold, but yellow. But uh, yeah, these are um, very and fine glitters that I'm going to be using today. I got this on Amazon. And I also got this new mold from Amazon. It's a butterfly box. Yay! I'm so excited. You know, I love butterflies. Anything to do with love, peace, and happiness is, is my thing. And Halloween. And skulls. And creepy things. <laughs> I'm a well-rounded person in more ways than one. <laughs> anyway, today, I've been looking at this and I was thinking, how should I do this? Uh, should I do the thing where I paint on with the uh, epoxy? in color, uh, let it cure, and then fill in the rest. Um, but this is kind of a reverse mold. If if this were down, like, like the inside has decorations, and like the, the flower, I could put resin in there and it's not going to go anywhere. I could put resin on top of this, but it's probably going to flow over because there's nothing to stop it. Oh, my trash man. So anyway, I just wanted to show you that. So what I'm going to do, what I'm going to try to do, and I'm going to talk louder right now, or just... Oh, I have this weird thing in my head. We hear that beep, beep, beep sound. When I hear stuff like that, I have to count. One, two, three, four. <laughs> it's just... Oh, there's something wrong with my brain or everybody else's. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, I just got this, 15 colors. I think it was $9, something like that. But the only, the only thing I don't like is it came with all these great colors, but no black, which I think black glitter is phenomenal. And I guess I'm gonna have to go to Michael's and get some. I have I have this black a holographic but I want some fine black glitter I had some and I used it all because it's actually quite helpful in doing dark black anyway let me move this away okay more than likely uh, I am going to go to voiceover at this point because this is going to take a long time so I'll talk to you as I'm going along, but just as the VO Carla. Voice over Carla. Yeah, VO Carla. Hello, it's VOK, voice over Carla, and I am mixing up my Let's Resin one to one. It's already mixed, but I'm mixing it with the glitters. So far, I'm just using straight glitters, I'm not using any mica powders. I have a dark blue, I have a light blue, and a mid-blue color. I'll be showing you the colors um, in a second here, because I mixed at the dark blue. I, I couldn't read it, it was too fast. <laughs> bright blue, bright blue is the darkest. And then I have a sky blue and a light blue. What I was showing you there, that one, it is a mica powder. It is the shell colored. All of these colors are by Let's Resin. And I put the shell in there because the th the, lo the last color needs to be... Um, it's like an ombre effect that I'm going for. 
and I need that last blue to be light like almost white so now I'm going to be using my silicone brush and um, putting on the dark blue first the darkest blue and I have a reference photo that I'm looking at of an actual butterfly butterfly I have to say the word twice <laughs> um, because I had to start a new voiceover thing here <laughs> uh, learning curves are fun so what I'm doing is literally putting on the darkest color in the middle the next color that I use will be the one in the middle that is the two colors mixed together it's a little bit of the dark and mostly the middle color of the blue so you can see there is a slight difference in the color and yep and then it'll be finishing this up trying to feather it out a little bit um, my hands kind of in the way so I, I think if uh, uh, where, my, where my hand is right there you can see where I've kind of feathered out the the dark blue and now what I'm doing is kind of fitting that lighter blue in there this is all just glitter so far glitter and resin that very very fine glitter powder is what it's called okay and I'm putting in a little bit more of the dark because I'm using that reference photo that you can't see because it's on my other computer behind me and here I got a little bit of blue on there which I didn't want because what I'm going to be doing on that well I'm not going to be doing anything yet to those polka dots because I still have to add the lightest color of blue or am I going to go ahead and do the polka dots now oh, okay I am so I put a little bit of the resin in that cup and then a sum of the shell colored mica powder and I'm going through and I'm covering up some of the dots on the side of that mold so that it resembles the actual butterfly because I'm going to be filling up the mold after I get these colors on with black so yeah now I'm adding the lighter color and I don't want it to touch the the white ones because I need the white to be um, in the middle of the black yeah so I think this is going to be really cool I am um, very excited you know I love butterflies I love glitter I was going to do this like a moth but I think I'm going to do that next I was looking at moths and I was thinking because it's fall it would be cool to do a witch moth so now I was putting in some of the glitter to try to fill this in and it's just the spaces are too small so I'll forget about it I'm just going to spray some alcohol on it and try to wipe it off the best I can there's probably some remaining not probably <laughs> there definitely is hello open your eyes but anyway that's what's going on here and now I'm using mica powder and kind of showed it to you if you've got a bigger screen you can see this right now I'm looking at the small screen on my editing program and I'm pulling out I'm pulling out the mica powders because I think it's gonna work easier than the glitters for this tiny tiny little you know flower petals and I don't even know what it is to tell you I think it's grasses and flowers a moon or a sun I don't know <laughs> I'm just like trying to figure it out I literally just almost said no nah, let's just do the whole thing black <laughs> oh gosh so yeah those are uh, the less resin mica colors that I'm pulling out purples because I love purple I wanted to do a purple butterfly but I'll do more because I was looking at the pictures today on Google and oh my gosh there are some beautiful butterflies and moths in this world. They don't even look real. 
And so I just chose this blue one because I thought it would be the easiest with this mold, hopefully, to kind of make a somewhat realistic butterfly. <laughs> Had a glitter, so realistic. Okay, so I don't have a lot to say about this. Oh, I'm just uh, putting, trying to put a little bit of color everywhere that color can go. I don't know. I don't, like I said, I don't like doing these mural things. That's why I don't want to do those animals that have the pictures in the bellies. I mean, I might love it someday, but I just feel so overwhelmed. So anyway, that's done. Um, getting ready to let these cure. I can't believe I just dropped my stick right there on that butterfly. I hope it's okay. I'm using up, I hope it's okay. I'm using up the extra resin here. Um, you know, I'm going to be making another little butterfly because my salted candle holders with the butterflies, oh my gosh, they're so cute. I could barely stand it. So, of course, I need more butterflies. And I'm finishing up, filling up my heart. My black heart. I think that's dark blue. I don't think it's black. <laughs> I don't know. So, <clears throat> well, I hope everybody's having a really great day today or tonight and things are going well. Beginning of fall. Woohoo! I could be, I could be happier, but not much because I love the tinge of coolness in the air. I love when you take a deep breath. Oh. Oh, it's just so awesome. I love it. Oh, somebody on the freeway is honking their horn. <sighs> yeah, and I just threw that in the paper thing. And I just noticed that I'm such a sloppy person when I'm doing this stuff. Oh my goodness. Oh well, I'm trying to keep it clean right now. So, <laughs> going back to real Carla's voice. Okay, you guys, um, I'll be back when these have dried so that I can add the black to the butterfly and finish it up hopefully today, six o'clock. So I'll be back for you for a flash, but about eight o'clock to pour in the black and then maybe finish it tonight. Okay, see you later. Well, see you, see you in one second. Ooh, I thought I lost it. Wow. Okay, so we're back for the second part. I have my resin mixed up. I'm going to turn this, uh, what do I have, like four ounces? I measured, and this was like two. I measured it <laughs> with alcohol, but then I got it on some of the color. Oh, chocolate, I see where I missed some more space. I got it on some of the color, and it came off. So I just took some... Um, what I have handy, some copper. <laughs> and anywhere where it came off, I, I just added some copper. Why not? <laughs> you know, it's like, oh, I can't get this off. I'll come, come on. I need a little bit more. Right there, that's empty. I'll just fill that up a little bit. Just be duo, too colored. I just see though where I've missed some of the color. Uh, of course, the minute I turn on the camera, it's like, oh, oh, that color came off that. And I didn't even put the alcohol up over the top of this. I went right to the line. But when I picked it up to pour it back, you know, it poured into a measuring cup and then pour it back in the bottle. Papacita. Of course, the alcohol went over the top and if there's one thing that will take the res the uh blah, 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 mica off of your work it's alcoholic <laughs> i mean alcohol period not even any fancy name just alcohol will do it so i'm just filling in everywhere that there's a some of it came off 
Most of it will still be the color that I put down at the bottom. Most of you know that. Oh, missed the little corner. Okay. Uh, so, anyway. Most of you know that whatever you put on the mold first, that's the color that's going to be there. No matter how many colors you put on top. So if by doing this uh, copper color over the top, even where there are colors, the only place you'll see copper when we unmold it will be the places of the this mold. I can't think what this is called. Well, and the places where the mold doesn't have uh, anything on it. Silicone. Gee, many Christmas. Work with something every day. And you're like, I don't know what it's called. I don't remember. Well, I think I shoot chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. How did I do that? I got like gold or something down in there. I wish it was gold. <laughs> Just made me think. <laughs> my cousin came to visit. Uh, our fam, our fa my cousins came. My cousin was my age, and we were, oh my goodness, fifth grade maybe. We walked up to the. Uh, Mayfair Market, which was our grocery store at the time, and we took a fake one dollar bill from a toy money and we folded it up really, really, really tiny, really tiny. And then we went into the liquor section, which is right by the door, and Donnie Adams was working at the counter. And Donnie Adams was a dream boat in high school, and I mean a dream boat, anyway. <laughs> We took a Nestle's Crisp bar, we we held it, and we threw down our fake money at them and said, keep the change. And then we ran out. He just laughed. He didn't even chase us because we realized he could still see us when we stopped to eat the candy. He, he, he just thought it was really funny. It was uh, probably not the best thing to do, but... I didn't get allowed. That's no excuses for it. I, I, I'm, I'm good at making excuses for myself, but uh, yeah, <laughs> it still cracks me up. Cracks me up. Made me think of it because I saw the gold and I was thinking, oh, I wish that was real gold. <laughs> it made me think. I was thinking because it's fake, and I thought, well, how can I make somebody think that that was real gold? And then it made me think of the candy bar situation. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Donnie Adams. Yeah. He was a cutie patootie. Had every, every female in Garden Grove checking him out. All the housewives. <laughs> All the females, no matter if they were in fourth or fifth grade, he was like, oh, he looked like Davy Jones of the monkeys. A reference that some of you will know. <laughs> Probably most of you. <laughs> hey, hey, we're the monkeys. Yeah, David, he looked like Davy Jones. Anyway, I just put some of my black flat paint in here because, and a few drops of Let's Resin, Resin Dye, which is the last of resin um, dye that I have for black. I'm gonna put, uh, I'm gonna put some more of this black glitter. I'm glad I found this. A bit more of the black glitter, give it a little bit of oomph, a little bit of pizzazz. Okay, just showing you guys this next step, and then we'll wait till it's done and then we'll unmold. Okay. 
doesn't look very dark on the stick, but it's way dark in the cup. Okay. All right, too bad, too bad. Let me wipe that off. Ah, uh, the butterfly. Oh, I didn't want him to have blue. Oh, it's better that I leave it than play with it, because I'll end up ripping it out. Alrighty, so just gonna pour this black straight onto this little baby. I'm basing this off of an actual butterfly. It's blue something. It actually kind of looks like this. It's a it's an interpretation of the butterfly I saw the picture of and using this mold. Wow, it's taken a lot. Okay. Now this. Let me see if I can just pour it down in here and then let it come up over. Oh dear, am I going to have to make more? I have some more. Yeah, I'm definitely going to need all of it. Let me just go ahead and put this in here. Uh, I'm just going to save a tiny... Well, I really didn't want black. If I had a little tiny bit left, I didn't want black, but... All right, now I'm going to have to, what am I going to do? I have uh, some of the Let's Resin mica powder. I really didn't want a mica powder look in this. I wanted it more severe, not creamy, but yeah, I got to do what you got to do. It's only resin. It's only resin. You know, as soon as I started telling myself that, that it's only resin and I'll stop freaking out and be so nervous about making every step, I've just had so much more fun with resin. I made some really cool things by just going, ugh, it's only resin. Let's see what will happen. Okay. I'm using Let's Resin. Uh, one-to-one -one ratio resin. Um, I can't think. My brain is not working right now. Okay. Sure hope this is enough. Yeah, I think this might be enough. Holy moly. Oof. All right. Wow. All right. Let me grab a... I'm going to use the bottom of the this thing here and kind of go around these sides. Checking for bubbles. Bubbles tend to love the edges. And that's my least favorite place to get a bubble. 
I don't care about bubbles that much, but when they're on the edge, it makes it, um, I don't know, unpleasant to hold or fondle. <laughs> you can't fondle your pieces. <laughs> okay, there's two ledges in here, so now I have to go around to get on the inside one. Oh, it's such a beautiful night. I love it. I guess on Thursday, we're going to have a low come in over Cali Southern California. And our temperatures are going to drop to the low 70s. I'm very excited about that. Very, very excited. Okay. For this one, I'm just going to go around... Gently with the with the soft end, because I don't want to knock any of the paint off of the other paint, the colored resin that I put on, like off of those little bumps. Little white bumps, because the actual butterfly that looks like this with the blue and the black has white bumps along the side. So, that's why I put those there. Oh, okay. Okay, yahoo. So, oh, I stuck my finger in it. Chocolate chips. Ugh. Ah, Frito pie. Ay, ay, ay. All right. A little monkey move on over. I'll let you guys go and I'll see you in, in a flash. Okay everybody they are cured. I've got this one piece sitting over here to the side because my heating mat is still pretty hot. Um, one second because this is driving me crazy how the heating mat looks. So let me just put this paper here. Plus it feels better on my hands. Of course, actually that feels pretty good on my hands, the heat <laughs> from the heating mat. So I'm gonna start with the, the opening act. The opening act is this one, <laughs> where I put the leftover uh, resin with the glitter, just glitter and resin in this. No idea. <laughs> oh, his little ear, but ear's gonna fall off. That's really, really cute. Wow. Did you know what I'm gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna put it on a dish and turn it into a light. Well, that's really cute, and it. It's translucent and not translucent. That is so pretty. Look at that. It's so glittery. Oh, I'll clean off the earbuds and all this stuff later. I'm not going to keep you on that. Okay, now for the bottom of the butterfly, the case part. This uh, resin is still somewhat malleable. <laughs> That's a good word for it. Malleable. So I don't want to destroy my bowl part. Let me, uh, I think I'll just spray a little bit of water in there. Just a little bit. See if I can get it to want to come loose. There we go. There we go. Okay, come on. Come on, come on. Well, like I'm coaxing a new puppy. Come on, you can go. Go on the paper. Come on. <laughs> new puppy, old dog. Same problem. Uh, they don't exactly understand the paper process anymore. Huh, Ripley? <laughs> I, buy pa I buy pads for him. So at night, 
He doesn't have to go out because it's dark and he can't see hardly. Oh, I can't get this undone. I'm trying. I really am trying without. Why won't you come out? Come on. It's just like literally. Uh... Ooh. Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh, 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 I need, um, <laughs> I don't know, I, I don't, I don't know where my, I know where my wipes are, but I don't want a wet wipe to drop, wipe up a little bit of the water that got in there. Holy moly, that is cute. That is really cute. I guess the next time I do this, I'll have a much better idea of what's in there. Um, wow. That's very cute. Doesn't hold a lot, but it looks like it'll hold like your favorite. Oh yeah, your f I have a couple favorite necklaces and some rings and stuff. Wow. That's actually really cute. I thought that was kind of dorky. I didn't think anyway that that was going to look okay. Well, what time is it? Oh, it's 12.43 at night. But I am a night owl. I'm trying to change it, though. I don't care if I have the same schedule as the rest of the world. I just kind of would like a, a little more daylight. <laughs> I feel kind of like a vampire. Like 4 o'clock, 5 o'clock in the morning, I go to sleep. Except for, how did vampires go to sleep at like six in the morning and then sleep until like nine o'clock at night in the summers? Never mind. Never mind. You know how my mind works. I, I'm going to start squirreling on you. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, look at that. You know what I don't like about it? Not a lot. I like it a lot, but what I don't like are these things. They're so big. I think, I think I see where I could improve. Um, this part came out exactly like I wanted it to, this part with the black dots showing up through the black. This kind of did, but uh, I have to be more careful when I do this, if I do this technique again, be more careful to not uh, let it go, let this other color like come up where the black is here. But this is a, uh, hmm. it's cute. Doesn't it look kind of like lungs? <laughs> oh, breathe. It does. It looks kind of like lungs. But I do like it. I really do like it. I am not. I don't. I'm not. I don't know. I um. I'm used, I guess, to the other butterfly molds I have that are like more delicately designed. This looks like it was going to be delicate, but it, like I said, this looks like, like, set of blue lungs in here. Blue lungs. Oh. And these still eat, these, these things. I could do without them. I think it would look better without them. Because with them, it just looks, they just look like, I don't know, they don't look right. They, they would look much cuter if these were not here, which I might just take them off and then put on like wire. I just can't stand these. Oh God, I just keep talking. I'm so sorry. But I can't stand them. I just want to cut them off. I think I'm going to cut them off. I don't think I can stand it. I don't know. I, I don't know if I could cut them. Like maybe uh, down. I don't 
don't know if I can do this. Because otherwise I'm just going to cut them off. I just don't like them. They're in the front to me. And... I don't know <laughs> the front. Oh my goodness, I am so Victoria. It's an affront to my sensibilities. Yeah, here we go. I'm going to see if I can cut them down. Or do I have to hold this where I get it right? Right like that. Something about the light right now is making it hard for me to see through my glasses. Oh, see that didn't work right. When I questioned where I was cutting, I went off track. All right. I'm not gonna worry too much about that because I can fix that when it hardens. All right. Sorry, y'all, for those of you that are like, I like the thick ones. I'm sure there are some people that do. I don't. So I'm going to change it because I just can't, I just can't, I just can't stand it. <laughs> I just can't. I just can't take it. I'm going to cut it down a little bit. Put that down a little bit more. Might be easier too if I just take this to the edge and take it off. Same with you to the edge. Take it off. They're still not perfect. They're not perfect, but to me it's better. It's just not better though, because this just still looks so clunky. <sighs> so maybe I just literally am going to have to cut them off all the way, but I'm not going to do it right now. I promise you I won't do that until I am ready to replace them. Like I go, oh yeah, this... This curly wire would look so much cuter or... Okay, I'm gonna stop. No, I'm not. I can't. <laughs> I can't. I just can't. I just can't stop until... until I'm a little bit more satisfied with how this looks. Maybe it's because they're so stiff, too. Maybe if they were uh, turned a little bit. They're just like two straight rods sticking out of a, this very sweet little butterfly. Yeah, I think they need to be a little bit turned, even though they just still look like two sausages. They really do. They just look like big old sausages hanging out of there. Well, I like it a little bit better, I guess. I just, I just, I just, I just, I just, ah! I need. Ah. Oh. I just need it to be a little different. Well. I like the whole idea of this mold. But I'm not happy with the them just doing the earbuds like that. I'm just leaving them like that. I think that looks better, but it still just doesn't look right. Well, butterfly baby. Uh, I'll fix the rest of this later. See if I can just get it. I don't know. I don't know. Well, anyway, let me know what you think. <laughs> I already know. 
I'm laughing because I already know there's going to be some people that are like, I liked it the way it was. Why did you do that? How could you cut up the things? Easy. I hated them. So let me just see something here. And that's, uh, I don't like that either. Oh my goodness. Little mother's cleaner there. <laughs> nope, I didn't like that either. Not at all. If anything, that's really should be silver or blue. Maybe blue. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, uh, I think too, it might be. Oh, part of this mat is... Part of this mold is matte. Oh, maybe that's... Oh, that's why the glitter down here is not comparable with this glitter. And can you see this glitter right here? It's all shiny. And this glitter is not. Oh, okay. Bummer. Bummer, bummer, bummer. That's why the glitter, like this blue glitter is the same blue glitter here. What a difference because it's matte mold. Oh no, I'm probably going to put um, resin on it. Yeah, I'm just going to make this flat with resin, clear resin tomorrow. Not tonight, tomorrow. Yeah. Because I can't stand that. It's making me crazy. It's just not cute. It is cute, but it's like, like, like I said, it's like the lungs because this, these look like so standing out. Where actually the whole thing should be glittered. The whole thing should be shiny. Not matte. That's what's driving me crazy more than anything is the matte look. Okay. Well, because now I could live with the ears. But the matte, like in here, that's matte. That's ugly. That should be shiny, glittery black, just like the black on here. This black, black is shiny. Like on this, it's shiny. It's glittery. The matte on here destroyed the glitter. Oh, me no happy. <laughs> not happy. I'll fix it tomorrow. Now that I know what's what's absolutely 100% wrong with it, I'll fix it tomorrow. Okay, you guys. I'll be, 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 be back in the morning. Gaga. Or in about two seconds. Hey, guys. I just needed to bring you back on real quick to show you the difference. If you can see this, I just decided to just go ahead and do this because it's driving me crazy. And I have done this half. And I don't have a, the light situation drives me bananas. Um, where's the better light? Over here? I think you can see the difference between this half and this half. I don't know. Hard for me to tell. Yeah. See, look at that. That's what we were supposed to have. See all that glitter? Yes. That's it. Not half like, like lungs. So I'm going to let you guys go right now. I'm going to finish it and then I'll... I'll I'll show it to you again. Okay? Bye. Hello. Okay. I fixed it. I'm so happy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so happy. Because even the antennas were matte. That's why I kept looking at it and saying, it's just like a piece of plastic. Look how beautiful this is now. <gasps> that I put the... I got rid of the matte. Yeah, it's so much better. Man, why would they sell something like that? I, I have a couple of molds that have raised detail and the lower details are matte. But see, now you can see 
what I was talking about. Like it's dark in the middle, then it goes to a slightly different color. I think you could see that. Yeah, and then the white spots in the black. This one I still, you know, it's still got a little mess. But actually, you know what I'm really surprised about is how much I love this. This. It is, to me, just absolutely beautiful. But together, oh my goodness. See, see how cute this is? It's got the little ripples on this side. I think it would be nice um, if this had a little tiny, you know, I guess I could add something on both sides so that it actually fit in here. But, you know, unless you're living on a boat, it's, it's not going to be doing this, right? If you're on a boat, it will. California, it might. <laughs> Back to life. We have earthquakes here. So anyway, I just had to show you because I am so happy now that my glitter is glittery. <laughs> Not like, it doesn't look like a set of lungs to me anymore. It just was so disappointing. Oh, I am so glad I used my eyeballs and saw that. So, yeah, I've got a couple little things that I did. This is with the leftover glitter. This is cute because I had some pink leftover glitter in there from the other yesterday, I think. And that this is my fill it up lid, my fill it up mold, extra mold. Yeah. And so this came out actually really, 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 really shiny and cute. Really cute. So shiny. You know the butterfly. Ooh. Why are we so mesmerized by holographic stuff? Changing the lights and the colors. It's, it's, it's all physics, but it's so fascinating. All right, you guys. Hope that you enjoyed this. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a subscription. Give me, give me, give me. If you wouldn't mind, please. YouTube requires it to push us along and all of us, all of us YouTubers here, yes, we have to bow to the YouTube algorithm and we have to beg you to please push the buttons. <laughs> it's free. It is free. It is not a trap by AI. <laughs> I love you guys. See you in the next video very soon now.